Chewbacca. If you haven't used one before, you should get one in your life. If you are breastfeeding, um, it like literally, I don't ever pump. I don't ever have to pump. And I have a huge stash of milk. Not huge, but I have a good couple days worth if I needed it. Um, but this thing, you literally just put it on. I mean, I'm not going to show you how I put it on, but... Um, you do this, you put it over your nipple, and then you squeeze this, and it like, and you let go of that, and it attaches. And while you're breastfeeding on one side, this collects all the milk on the other side, and it literally fills up to like, I usually get like one to two ounces every time. <laughs> My brat, she has a mustache on her face um, from Crystal Light. Anyways, look at the snow outside my cousin's new house it like everybody was freaking out because it snowed for I mean it snowed for like 12 hours I think straight then it warmed up and I mean look there's not even any snow on top of the house there's I mean it's already all melting so whatevs I'm ready for this winter to be over back to uh, what I was talking about this thing is like super awesome so, if you're a breastfeeding mom, I would totally order one of these. Um, I would, didn't intend on breastfeeding. I mean, I, I intended on it, but I wasn't su successful with my other kids. So, getting this and being able to collect some milk, um, I don't know. It, like, kind of encourages you to keep going, you know? It's kind of like a... It's really cool. I mean, if you use it you know what I'm talking about. Um, especially if you if it's like your first time and then you're like, oh my God, it's filling up with milk. And you don't even feel it. Like it's not like a breast pump where you like you feel it tugging on your nipple or whatever. Like this literally you just attach it to your tit and you get some milk. And then I just pour it into like a little breastfeeding bag or um, breast milk bag, collection bag. And I date it and I put it in the freezer. I'll put it in the fridge. Um, this has a little plug too, but I lost it, but, um, I'll put it, I'll pour it in the fridge if it's only like an ounce or two, and then I'll do it again on the other side, and then I'll collect another couple ounces, and then I usually like to store between four and six ounces in each bag, and, because that's about the amount that he eats, um, uh, like I look breast horrible. Milk. Yeah, my hair smells amazing though. Um, I've been using the Biolage purple shampoo and conditioner and I love it it smells amazing it makes my hair smell amazing and it literally makes my hair smell good for like three days because I don't wash my hair every day and I washed my hair last night but um anyways I look like a <laughs> anyways so yeah I'll try to film me getting ready and getting this skin looking a little better but I don't know, like I wanna pick so bad, but I know I, I shouldn't, shouldn't do it. Um, but fun little fact, I always have dark circles around my eyes because, I don't know, I think it's hereditary. Um, a lot of my aunts in Mexico, their eyes are like this, so. Um, <clears throat> I guess they're like allergy shiners or whatever, but Mine are permanent. They've been like this my whole life. So anyways, I'm going to go do what I said I'm gonna do. Don't mind the mess in the back. I just made some chorizo and papas and I'm not cleaning it up right now. So I will see you in a minute. <laughs> Ezreal, he just woke up from a nap, huh, baby? He likes to take naps. <laughs> He only sleeps for like 15, 20 minutes stops. But at least I got to cook breakfast, huh? Mm. A late breakfast, because it's like one o'clock. No. Oh my God, Gina, you need to go wash your face. No. <laughs> but yeah, my little baby. Hi. Hi, my chulo. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Aren't they like twins? 
They look like their dad. Poor kids. <laughs> huh, baby? Oh, I think he's getting hungry. Okay, so I just did a feeding and I got about one ounce. About a little bit, a little bit more than one ounce um, off of one boob. So, yes, I'm gonna put this in the fridge and I'm just gonna kind of collect throughout the day and then I'll freeze what I get. And, or I might just not freeze it because I have a few appointments this week that I might have to leave the baby. Um, it'd be good to have this on hand. <coughs> the only thing is like, look, it collects like my hair. I shed like a freaking, I don't know, like a dog, but look at like, the hairs that, it's like sticky on the outside because it's silicone. So it like picks up all the little stray pelos. Anyways, it's clean on the inside. I just cleaned it, so. But yeah, I'm gonna put this in the fridge. Look at this mess right here. About to fix this up. I'm just spraying this little prep spray. I got this in my boxy charm. This last month. January's. January's box. So I always start and just do my let's see, I should have had this stuff ready. Out here I have the biggest mess in the world in my bathroom like not even lying i'm not even going to show it because it's it's pretty bad but oh of course I'm trying to find my eyebrow pencil oh here it is so this is the one i've been using and i love it it is the revolution it's only like six dollars which I'll take that. So I'm gonna use my little palette here for my mirror because it's hard to do your makeup looking in the camera trying to do the do both of the things. So here we go. So first off, I am going to fill in my brows, which need some maintenance here, but I'm not not about that life right now because I'm one lazy I hate going into places and two I have been thinking about doing um, what is it called microblading my friends two of my friends have gotten them done already and I'm like yes the brows are what take me the longest so if I, um, look at how crazy that looks. So if I, I think if I get my brows done, I'll be able to get ready real quick. Cause I'm, I don't take a long time actually. I really don't. Compared to some of my friends or some people that I can compare myself to that literally will do minimal makeup compared to me. I, I wear a lot of makeup, but I know people that don't wear a lot of makeup to take forever, ever, ever. Anyways, I fill them in. They look crazy right now, but don't worry. They get fixed. So I fill them in. I brush them out. This is where it starts to look a little, a little crazy. I brush them out. It just gives them a little bit of a hair-like look when you do this, I guess. I don't know. I'm not a professional, but this is just what I do. <clears throat> I noticed my right, or my left eyebrow, like I have less hairs in the front on this side, so I like to go in and kind of fill them in. Like, this is not a tutorial, people. This is just what I do. So, anyways. Next up, I take... This is what I've been doing lately. This isn't, like, a permanent thing. I change my routine up, like, all the time. Just because why not? It's fun to do. So, once I do that, I take my... Concealer. I've been using this, um, what is this brand? 
Juvia's place. And it's, this is 21. It's really white. It's really, really, really white. And I didn't realize that when I bought it, but I like it. I mean, I don't like it, like it, but to carve out my brows, it works pretty well. So anyways, I go through, I carve out my brows, yada yada. I'll probably just speed through this part. <laughs> Anyways, let's fix this craziness before. This is like my, my least favorite part of my face when I have to do my brows and my shadow. So next step, I take my setting powder. And I use Airspun. Give me shit about it, I don't care. I love it. I'll use other ones. I mean, I, don't, I really am not particular about it. Actually, I'm. that's a lie. I have used a few that um, were like really dry and cakey. Like you, you go to set something and it like, I don't know, it stays or it leaves it really white. But this, I mean, this literally I just pat on just to kind of like set. I don't, I don't bake or whatever. I don't think people do that anymore, do they? <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, so once this situation is ready, I take my eyeshadow brush and I do my eyeshadow. But anyways, now I'm gonna do my what do you call it? So I'm gonna do my eyeliner and it's kind of tedious, so bear with me. I'm just gonna do a little wing. Nothing crazy today. It's Sunday. We're just chilling. I mean, I have things I want to go do, but I don't think I'm going to do it because I always say I'm going to do stuff and I don't. So just a little simple wing here. And we'll do the other side. This eyeliner is the shit. I'll tell you that. I don't like um, these kind of eyeliners. I don't usually use these. I use like a brush kind, but I ran out and I haven't ordered them because I use, they're literally like, the ones I love are the, I think they're like LA Girl or something like that, like the really cheap ones. The brush is like my favorite. And it's really easy to do a wing with the other brush, but I've been using this one and it's been like a champ. And this is the Betty Boop uh, Ipsy one. I got this in one of my Ipsy bags. I don't even know when. I think a couple months ago or something. Let's do this mascara real quick. I don't have a preferred mascara either. I use whatever I have. Like I said, I've been slacking on the makeup game here. I don't go out and buy makeup really, unless it's foundation. So anyways, I do my top lashes, and then I take my brush and I do my foundation. Once I'm at this point, I'm like, I'm almost done, so we're good. If I could get my eyes tattooed, <laughs> I'd be ready in like two minutes. So anyways, I'm going to I just, this is a new brush. I'm using a new brush because I'm thinking maybe that's why I was breaking out. So I'm gonna paint on my face here. And I don't really use a lot, it looks like a lot, but this is really full coverage. This, it's the Juvia's 
Juvia's Place. I always forget the full name. Juvia's Place, I Am Magic. Velvety Matte Foundation. And I'm using the color Martinique. Martinique. Martin. Martin. <coughs> Niki. Martinique. I don't know. Martinique 550. Anyway. <laughs> I'm just gonna do a little extra today since I'm filming so I'm gonna put a little bit of eyeshadow underneath my eyes you know this helps me a lot kind of kind of brings it all together but See how I have those dark circles? I have those always, so I've learned to live with it. I don't I don't really fuss with it anymore. It's just part of me, part of what I look like. You gotta accept yourself, people. As I cover my face with makeup. But yes, I accept myself. I just love to glam it up, you know? So anyways, I'm going to do my found or my bronzer. lashes on today I usually do but I think I think that's a little too extra for Sunday at home so what I'm going to do is blow dry my hair real quick and then I'll <laughs> Definitely need a new straightener. I've had this for, I don't know. I think I bought this like seven, eight years ago. It's still running like a champ, but I need a new one because it's kind of, I feel like it doesn't get hot and, as hot as it used to. <laughs> So now I'll straighten my hair. Probably just, I'll be fast forwarding through all of this. videos I mean I know I watch a lot of YouTube so I know like a few videos that I want to do I kind of want to do some prank videos on my kids I don't think it would be a good idea to do it on my husband he's not like <laughs> it would be like it wouldn't be funny I don't think he'd probably get all mad but maybe that'd make a better video huh but there's like a few pranks that I would like to pull on my kids. My daughter is really sensitive though, so I'm like, I gotta be careful when I'm if I'm pranking her, you know? Cause she's probably gonna take it too personal. But anyways, this is, I think this is as much as I'm gonna do today. Usually I'll straighten it a lot more just so that it looks a lot smoother. But I'm feeling it today. So, but this is it, guys. This is what I do. This is how I get ready. Okay, forgot to do this. I'm gonna spray it again with this. This you can prep your skin with and do it afterwards to set it. And then, um, you can do it later to kind of give you another, like a refresher. So I'm gonna spray it and it's, it feels really good. It's like aloe, I think. 
I don't know what's in it. Yep, it has aloe, witch hazel, electrolytes. Yeah, so cool. Anyways, I'm gonna set my makeup now. And sorry if the quality on this video isn't that great. Uh, this is my iPhone 8. I haven't upgraded yet. But, um, and this is the front camera. I wanted to be able to see myself, so. Um, anyways. This is the finished look. Okay. <laughs> I literally... <laughs> just dropped everything off of my window I have my camera set up in front of my window so that I could get the light okay so I'm gonna but. go ahead and close this video out I um, dropped everything out of my window still in my bathroom so I have to go clean that up <laughs> but anyways yeah my baby's sleeping right now and I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna make for dinner so I can get that ready and um, but that's about it. But thank you for watching. If you are watching, if you enjoyed it, make sure you like, uh, comment, and subscribe. Leave me some comments on what videos you'd like to see from me. Um, this is really fun for me, so I love editing and posting these videos. It's really a nice little hobby. Um, go ahead and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a video. And I uh, will be back with some more videos later. Bye!